YouTube, it's your girl, Vivaly Juicy, and welcome to episode 3 of my LP, Life is Mrs. Towns. A quick recap of episode 2. If you didn't see it, I don't know why you didn't. You should be ashamed of yourself, and you should go back and watch it before you actually watch this episode. But in episode 2, at the end, we got the official announcement that Skylar here is pregnant. She is prego, and we are very excited about that. Uh, let me know what you think she's going to have in the comment section below. You think she's going to have a boy or a girl? See, in her wants, Skylar wants a girl. And Eli wants... He wants a boy, so we'll see who get their wish. <laughs> so, uh, we at where we left off last time. As I made them go to bed, who's waking up first? They both kind of waking up at the same time. Cool beans. Um, in this episode, I really don't know what's going to happen. I saw a comment in the last episode. That's why you guys need to leave more comments on my videos because I really do take your suggestions into context and I try to do my best and implement that in the LP. We're gonna let Eli make go to bed. And you could use the bathroom. Woo, what am I doing? So uh the comment said that Eli should take the day off and actually take Skylar out somewhere. And I was thinking that's a pretty good idea. But <laughs> I was like, uh, he doesn't work that long anyway, so, you know what, he don't have to do all that. So, once he get off of work, as you can see, he works from, where is it, oh, God. he works from uh, 9 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. So, 2.30 is way than more than enough time for him to still take Skylar out once he get back from work, so that's what he gonna do. Do we have any leftover food? We got, we got waffles, sweet. Because I could not remember to save my life. And today, as you, oh, it looks so nice outside in the fall time in Lucky Ponds. Look at the leaves falling off the trees. It looks so cute. I know that his carpool is coming. He is going to be to work. Skylar does not have to go to work, so I don't know why that showed up. But, uh, yeah, this is Skylar with her ugly maternal clothes. I guess this is technically her second day of being pregnant. So, I, I'm not really I'm not really sure. She might have her baby the next day or the day after that. I can never keep up with that with the Sims. I, I just can't. I don't know. Don't judge me. But, uh, after Skylar gets her some breakfast in her stomach, we're actually going to run to the bookstore and get a pregnancy book. And we're going to have her to read up on that. And we're also going to get her some logic books because she really need to work on her logic uh, skill. It's just, it's just bad. Look, like, her logic is supposed to be way up to here. She only has two, so that that's just awful. But we're going to work on that. We're going to have a lot of time to work on that while she's staying home with the baby. She'll get a lot of reading done and get her skills up and etc. So, you know, we don't, we don't have to worry about that. <laughs> so, yeah. Also, if you guys haven't been stopping by my streams lately, hopefully you guys are because I do stream The Sims 3, but I play with completely different family. I would never play with the families that I'm doing LPs on because that kind of like spoils the moment. I don't know if that makes sense, but that's what it does in my opinion. I'm going to watch Eli go off to work and... Oh, my game is lagging a little bit. Uh-oh. Okay, it's fine now. I was about to say, please don't start lagging because I'd be very upset. But, uh, what was I saying? I don't know. You guys need to check out my streams. Uh, I will have the link to my live stream down in the description for you to follow. And also, once you follow me, then you will get, let's see, meet fellow scientists, because I still don't believe he met all of them. You will get an email, uh, when I'm live streaming, so you guys should check that out. Oh, and it's raining again. Just my luck. It always rains in Lucky Palms. I swear, to be the desert, it rains a lot. Just a whole lot, a whole lot. <laughs> uh, so we're gonna have to, let's get back on to Scowler. Let's get um her to the bookstore to get that pregnancy book. Can you clean that up, Scowler? You don't need to read that book. You need to read. Oh, it's not actually raining, it's hailing, actually. Oh, that's great. <laughs> uh, we're going to have her to go to the bookstore, which is, where is it? It's not that far, so good for us. <laughs> Very good for us. And she's running, too. I don't know what's up with my Sims and them running lately. And my game is still kind of lagging a little bit. I believe it's when the weather changes. When I'm in Lucky Palms, my game starts to lag, as you can see. It's, it's, it's lagging pretty bad right now. I don't know what the crap that is going on. 
But uh, hopefully it gets fixed. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure because um, my game has started to act really retarded lately because... I don't mean to say or use that word. That was a bad word. My game starts to act out of the normal way it's supposed to act lately since I've been using that family that I stream with because I don't like just making them have babies back to back. Their household is at capacity. And I really think that kind of messed up my game a little bit. But I love that family. So, uh, that's fine. This, this pregnancy book, I don't even know where it is. I think it's in general. You go all the way down, I believe. Let's see, let's see. Um, here we go. Baby and coming. Preparing with that. Yeah, that word. <laughs> and, uh, let's get some logic books. I think we have level one in the bookcase. If they have a bookcase at home, they should. They have a lot of bookcases, right? If I can remember, they have a lot of bookcases. So, we're going to just get the second edition. That's all. That's 800, 800 Samoans for two books. I would never in my life spend that much for books. I never will. Well, you know you have to spend that much for, like, school books or whatever, but that is a lot. Just a lot. As you can see, she wants to woohoo with Eli. She just nasty. Even though she knocked up, she's still that same old scholar. <laughs> Let's see how Eli's doing. Looks like she's doing all right. Hopefully, by the time he gets off of work, it'll be kind of like, it'll be a little after lunchtime, and they should be hungry by then. What do we got out here? Can you please clean this up? Because I do not like to have newspapers all outside in front of the door. It looks bad. We don't want the neighbors to think we're just filthy and dirty. We don't want that. <laughs> so, um, where is that baby book? She's going to read this pregnancy book. Hopefully, she'll have it done by the time that, uh, oh, we got some laundry to do. Hold on. We're going to move those clothes to the dryer, and then we're going to have her read the pregnancy book. And I don't even know how long that's going to take, but hopefully not too long. Hopefully she's done by the time that uh, Eli gets home. And I might do a little cut scene because I know it's going to get kind of boring just watching her sit there and read a pregnancy book. But uh, I don't know. We'll see what happens. We'll, we'll just see. And I'm really kind of excited. She might be having this baby tomorrow, actually, and you guys will not see that. <laughs> we'll wait till the next episode so it's kind of a surprise, you know. And uh, I'm kind of just thinking in my head, oh, she just want to read the book. She doesn't care. Well, she could just sit there and read the book. I'm really excited to see what the baby's going to look like once I get a toddler. I don't know how long I want the baby to be a baby, but I really don't like babies. <laughs> I probably will let the baby be a baby for about two, three days. I think three days is all. I think you could do two. I might let the baby be a baby for three days, and then I can't wait to see what the baby going to look like as a toddler. A lot of people say that they want the baby to kind of look like Eli, but then have a scholar hair color. I'd be very amazed if the baby come out with pink hair. That would be crazy, you know? So, um, all right. <laughs> Uh, Skylar sit here and read her pregnancy book. I will come back in a second for you guys, but it might be a, a couple of minutes for me. And I'll come back once Eli is on his way home. So, I'll be right back, you guys. Okay, you guys, I am back. Eli just got off of work. And Eli, I said, I was about to say Eli. <laughs> and Skylar had just finished actually reading the pregnancy book. Uh, hopefully we'll have time to get... Uh, Eli to read the pregnancy book as well because he need to learn a few things. This is his first baby as well. They really don't know much and they need to learn all that they can. So he needs to read the book as well. But uh, yeah, we're going to have him to do that. But we're going to let him go home and uh, kind of freshen up, change his clothes, get out of his ugly work clothes. And we're going to have him to take Skylar out for lunch. I mean, they're not that hungry, but they're getting hungry. So... We're going to do that and go on a nice little uh, lunch date to the bistro, I guess. So, uh, let's get that on the way. Hello, Eli. Let's um, change to his everyday wear. He doesn't have to pee, but um, we're going to have him clean that up, too. Uh, what is Skylar doing? Get off the computer, Skylar. We're going to have her uh, use the bathroom. Then uh, there she go with her little pregnant walk. She getting big. She's definitely gonna have that baby next episode, and I'm gonna be so happy. You guys have no idea. Don't read anything. You're gonna um be a little romantic, and he's going to dip kiss.
kiss her. Hey, now. They haven't really interacted with one another since, you know, yesterday. And he has a little baby on his brain. He wants a boy so bad. Hopefully, he'll get his wish. But, you know, you never know what you're going to have. You never know. You just, you just never know. <laughs> So go ahead and get a little dip kiss, Eli, even though it's in the bathroom. That's that's fine, you know. It's still romantic, nonetheless. You can see her little belly is growing. It was not that big when she first woke up. So cute. Ah, it's so precious. Okay, uh, y you guys need to um need to form a group. I don't know why I'm not getting the option to, to uh, form a group, but y'all need to form a group. <laughs> there you go. Now he can form a group. Hurry up and form a group so you guys can go eat. You're getting hungry. And I might let them go to the movies as well. Well, they might miss it, actually, because by the time they finish eating, the movie, okay, I think the movie is like five, so they're going to miss it. She's like, yeah, let's chill. Okay, so let's have them. Where is the little bistro here? And Lucky Palms. Is this it? Yes, I think it's it. Eat outside with group. A hundred dollars. Woo! A lot of money. That's a fancy bistro. Very fancy. So let them uh, actually go out. It's actually their first time going out since they've been married, which is so cute. Even though you're married and you're pregnant, don't mean you can't still go out and have fun. So we always going to make sure they have time to have one-on-one -on -one with one another go out to eat and go into the movies and stuff even after the baby comes around the baby could use the babysitter you know that's no biggie but look at Eli car fly and it's raining again I might actually turn the rain off because I think that's what actually lags well their game file well like your palms in general you leave in Skylar you know she pregnant she can't walk that fast Look at her. She just straggling behind like this man done left me. I'm pregnant with his child. It's raining. Ugh. And he just ran without me. But she's like, I, he is so lucky that I love him. He is so lucky. And I wish he had on a different outfit. The maternal, I said maternal. <laughs> Those maternal clothes are so ugly. And he's just looking at the rain like, yeah, it's raining. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I wonder what food they're going to come out with. I really do. You never know. Like... Sometimes it make me mad when they go and eat at a bistro and then they come out with like waffles or something they could have made at home. Like you're supposed to come out with something kind of expensive like steak or lobster or grilled salmon or something like that. But they end up coming out with like waffles and mac and cheese and stuff like that. It's crazy. Skylar was paid 837 simoleons for personal time off. So we're still getting that money rolling in here. They need to come on outside. I don't even know why I'm making them eat outside anyway. I just thought about that. It's raining. But I had picked that choice before uh, they actually went. I didn't know it was going to rain. So, sorry, you guys. If they decide to stay in, I don't know if Skylar came out. It has a little cover over the table, so it's not that bad. See, that's, that's what I'm talking about, Eli. Eli got lobster. That's what you're supposed to come out with. And Skylar just came out with stew surprise. But that's all right, you know. That's perfectly okay. <laughs> I'm going to let them go home since it is raining, but that's perfectly okay because, you know what, Skylar can't eat a lot of things because it kind of makes her sick because she's pregnant, you know, so it's not that bad. So after Eli eats, you're going to take him and Skylar home. Skylar, you know, she eating for two, so, you know, she just eats a lot faster. Sit down, Skylar. Just sit down and wait for Eli to finish. Because you just gobble yours up. We know you pregnant and all, but you ain't got to be eating like that out in public. Uh-oh. We have an emergency, as you can see. Oh, wait, Eli. Just sit just sit right there. As you can see, that this is my second time I have to go do this with Skylar. As you know, everybody knows that she's in a medical career. So people just be out and about. And they're like, oh, I suddenly don't feel so well. I wish there was a doctor around. So now we got to go check on this woman. I don't even know. Oh, she's way over here. So we're going to let uh, Skylar give her medical attention. Just just sit right there. Uh, just sit right there, Eli. And Skylar is going to handle this, okay? <laughs> Where did she go? Where did the lady go? I don't want to talk about dogs. We're trying to give medical attention to this lady. And it's going to take 
scowl her a while to get over there because you know she is pregnant <laughs> she's like lord i'm pregnant it's raining i'm trying to go home and i still gotta take care of people and give them medical attention so hopefully e that i say e that <laughs> hopefully eli doesn't leave her he's talking to somebody while she's giving this person medical attention everybody's all frightened and scared wait i wonder what scowl gonna give her Oh, she gotta do another test on her. I guess she don't know what's wrong with her. Oh, she gotta do another test. Something's really seriously wrong with this lady. Skylar came and figured it out. And women are flirting with Eli. Lord have mercy. She's still doing tests on her. I guess Skylar can't figure it out. Something Skylar never seen before. She just punched her in the- What is she doing? She was just like- She just put her hands on her and... Can you take uh, Skylar home, Eli? Thank you very much. Do you see that? <laughs> Skylar just like put her hands on her and she was relieved. Skylar is Jesus on the low. She just put the hands of God on her right there and she was just fine and perfect. <laughs> oh my god, that was weird. It was so lucky you were nearby when I had that sudden feeling of nausea. Thank you so much. That was weird. I never saw that. She was just touching her and she was just fine. <laughs> so we go let these uh this lovely couple go home. They're all wet. Well, Eli's wet. I don't know why he wasn't using his umbrella for whatever reason. He wasn't using his umbrella. So he had nobody to blame but himself that he's soaking wet. So we're going to make sure he get all nice and dry. Uh, Skylar, sweetheart, why don't you, um, just watch a little TV, and Eli, change out of those soaking wet clothes, can you? You can actually just change into your, uh, to your sleepwear. Is he about to watch TV? I guess he was. Uh, and watch some TV. So, I think I'm about to end the episode right here, you guys. Just let this lovely couple sit here together and watch TV. How about you cuddle with your wife? Just cuddle on the sofa. We're going to let this lovely couple just uh, cuddle and watch TV. So, uh, so I watch the TV and cuddle with her. So, yeah. Uh, don't forget to like this video if you haven't already. And make sure you subscribe if you're new to my channel. I'm going to try to bring more Call of Duty back to my channel because a new DLC is about to come out for it. Uh, stop watching TV and cuddle. Just cuddle. Just cuddle while I talk. Just cuddle while I talk. Uh, a new DLC is coming out, so I'll be uh, uploading more Call of Duty Ghost videos. Hopefully you guys enjoy that and don't be a stick in the mud about it. I know you like your Sims 3. And I'm bringing you guys still, bring you guys to uh, Sims 3 LP, so don't worry about that. And uh, next episode, hopefully Skylar will be having his baby. Hopefully you guys are ready. I'm very excited myself. And, uh, yeah, let me know in the comment section. you think it's going to be a boy or a girl? You don't have to name names. I already got a name for either or. So, just want you guys to know that. I will see you guys next week for episode four. And, uh, yeah, follow all those links down in the description and stuff like that. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Viva Juicy. Peace.